What we're going to do in this video is look at two rectangles that have the exact same area, and we're going to measure each of them with a different square unit. So this top unit right over here, this is a square foot. So that means its height is one foot, and its width right here is one foot. Now this square unit over here, this is completely made up, and I'm going to call this a voot or voot. So this right over here is one voot. And this over here, the width is one voot. So this entire thing is a one square, one square voot, while this top one, of course, is one square foot. Now let's measure each of the let's measure the top rectangle in terms of square feet, and let's measure the bottom rectangle in terms of square, I guess I could say feet. All right. So first the top rectangle. So we have one, two square feet, three square feet, four square feet, five square feet, and then we have like six square feet. And then we're going to have a, need to have another six square feet down here. So that's seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. So when I tile these square feet onto our original rectangle, it looks like we have 12 square feet. And so I could write its area like this 12 square feet. Now what about this one in terms of veet? In one, you could have a square voot or many square veet. Let me do the same exercise here. That's one square voot. This is two square veet, I could say. And then this is three square veet. So the same area could either be 12 square feet or it could be three square, square feet. And I want you to think about whether that makes sense. Think about how many square feet would make up one square foot. In fact, we can figure that out on our own right over here. So that's one square foot. This is two square feet. This is three square feet. And then four square feet. So it looks like four square feet make up one square foot. And so think about, it. does it make sense that three square feet is the same thing as 12 square feet?